The Flathead County Sheriff's Office has two new officers to put a stop to Flathead drug crimes. Marin Sue takes us to Kalispell where she got to meet the brand new Flathead County K-9 unit. If you look closely enough, you might see a little face peeking out of here. That's Victor, and Victor is one of the brand new canines with the Flathead County Sheriff's Office. They're different than your household pet. Um, they, they are uh, highly driven. They're, they're full of energy. Matt Vanderark and Charles Pasola are the two canine handlers for the Flathead County Sheriff's Office. Vanderark says this new program is designed to stop drug crimes in our valley. We're talking pound levels every day that are coming through our county, and having this tool to actually go out and find them, that it's, it's huge for our community. How the dogs learn is simple, and it looks like this. Finding the drug means they get praise in a tennis ball. Vander Ark and Pasola never direct their dogs towards the drug. The dogs learn to find drugs on their own. The bond between handler and dog is special, but Pasola says how he treats Sawyer at home is different. My dog at home, we, we would take outside and throw a ball with. Um, she gets treats and loved on and hugs and things like that. And it's not that we don't love on this dog, um, but all of its gratification and emotion and love comes from working. So we want to make sure that it doesn't get fulfilled that at home. Otherwise, it wouldn't have any reason or desire to go to work. At $25,000 a dog, Vander Ark says 95% of the program is funded through donations. Dogs themselves and the training, that's all community funded. While Sawyer and Victor aren't working, they spend their time in this temperature controlled patrol car to keep them safe, hydrated and fed. Victor and Sawyer could be up and working anywhere from four to six weeks from now. In Kalispell, Marin Sioux, MTN News.